Hello everyone, welcome back to another Premiere Pro tutorial. In this one, I'm going to show you how to create a speed ramp. I've got this regular footage here of a car just sort of rotating slowly, a little graphic there. And then here we go. I've got it one second, bang, speed ramps in and it's a gradual increase. How did I do that? Let me show you in about 60 to 90 seconds. Let's delete everything. Start from scratch. Okay, first step, drag and drop your video onto your timeline like I've done here. Now, this is optional. But basically, I want to increase the size of this V1 so I can show you a little more of what I'm doing here. So I'm just drastically increasing the size of the video track. Okay, good. I'm going to zoom in a little more. Now, the next step is you'll see that little uh, FX box there. It's kind of hard to see if you're not careful. Right click on it, making sure you're hovering over top of it. And when you do that, you get the option to go time remapping speed. Click on that and then you get this purple with a white line. This is your remapping speed line. But before I go ahead and adjust the speed, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to move this timeline or playhead to about the one second mark because that's where I want the uh, speed ramp to start. Now I'm over the one second mark. I'm going to hold down the command key on a Mac, the control C on a PC, and you'll see that little plus sign by the arrow. That means I can apply basically a keyframe, a time remapping keyframe. Left click on that and presto. I'll zoom in a little bit and you will see that I've got this cool looking thing here. So what am I going to do? The next step is I'm going to actually grab, I'm going to hover over the white line and then I'm going to push it way up and I'm going to go to something like 900%. Let's go to a thousand percent for effect. Okay. Yeah. Really go for it. Okay. Good. And we're really zoomed in. So here's what it looks like already. Go boom. And that might be all you need. But if you want to make the speed ramp a gradual uh, effect, you'll see here that when I hover over this, you'll see that I get that little arrow, the double headed arrow. If I drag this one thing out a little bit, if I drag one of the little handles out, you'll see here that I get this angle. And now watch what happens. It slowly speeds up. Again, it's optional. You may or may not want to go down that path. But that's how you do speed ramps in Premiere Pro.